Hello, and welcome to Lightworks. This is Drag and Drop in the Timeline Continued, Part 3. So far, when we've been looking at Drag and Drop, we've focused on single segments, moving them around, using replace and insert modes, and moving them across tracks. What if you want to copy a group of clips, or a specific marked range of your timeline? All the same techniques we've learned can apply to a marked range. Let's have a look at that. I'm going to snap to the previous edit point, mark an in-point. I'm going to use the next edit point button to accurately mark these four clips in a range. Of course you don't have to specifically snap your ranges to the cut points. Click in the center of any of the clips in the marked group. Click, hold, drag left and right. you see all the clips move at the same time. My default mode is replace. I right, release, they're moved, and everything's overwritten beneath them. If I wanted to use my shift modifier to enter drag and drop insert mode, let's give that a go. Click and hold, move, and now press the shift key to enable the insert mode. Let's put this group of clips and snap it just there. Release to splice them in. Now we've left a gap where the media has been lifted from and the four shots have been spliced in here. As you're working with mark and parked ranges, remember that the vertical segment movement across tracks is the same as when we looked at individual clips. So if I pick this group up again, I can drag the V tracks up and down, doing the same with the A tracks, do be careful as you move these segments vertically, if you don't have the destination tracks available then your segments could be removed from your edit. If I release here I've moved the audio from this out of the edit. Let's do a copy and insert of the marked region. First click control, click in the middle of a segment in the marked range and start to move. You can now release the control key and concentrate on the drag and drop mode. I press the shift key now, change the cursor head to insert and let's drop this in just splice it straight after itself. And there's the duplicate of this. And of course don't forget using the marked range and the copy is how you can make duplicate sub-edits of sections. Let's say we wanted a duplicate of this range to work out some other ideas. Press control, click, drag, drop it into the bin and now we've got our edit section ready to try something else from our master. We hope that's helpful. Thanks for watching.